If at first you don't succeed, try and try and try again. NASA will try to launch its new moon rocket this weekend after complications prevented Artemis 1 from lifting off last Monday. Managers claim they saw one of the engines leaking as one of the units failed to reach the proper temperature for hydrogen fuel. But the launch director says Saturday's attempt will be weather dependent. So it really all depends on, you know, when we have a weather issue. Uh, if we got started tanking on time and the weather wasn't an issue at tanking, then certainly, you know, we would have the, the balance of the window, which is expected to be about two hours to go resolve that. But it's tough to speculate because it all depends upon, um, you know, when we get the weather issues and, and what that impacts. The 322-foot rocket, the most powerful ever built by NASA, remains on its pad at Kennedy Space Center, with an empty crew capsule named Orion on top. Artemis 1 will send the unmanned capsule into lunar orbit and back on a mission that will take six weeks from liftoff to splashdown. Already years behind schedule, the 4.1 billion euro test flight is the opening shot in NASA's Artemis moon exploration program named after the twin sister of Apollo in Greek mythology. Astronauts can strap in as soon as 2024 for a lap around the moon and actually attempt a lunar landing in 2025.